Hi everyone, I am Christine May S. Napiri from BS Bio 2A. Today, I am going to report the family of Linsai CA. So here are the table of contents, the definition of Linsai CA, morphology and characteristics, the distribution, cultivation, the identification and key to the species, and of course, the example of representative species. So, what is Linsaiceae? Linsaiceae is a pantropical family of ferns in the order of Polypodiales. It contains six or seven genera with about 220 known species, some of which also extend into the more temperate region of um, Eastern Asia, New Zealand, and South America. For more than a century, these ferns were considered part of the Davalia CA. Then, starting in the mid 20th century, they began to be transferred to the Densteidia CA. So, the molecular data supported the separation of Linsai CA into its own family, which was proposed in 1970. The morphology and characteristics For the rhizomes, it is short creeping or sometimes long and rampant, protostelic cloth with scales. And the scales are consisting of two to four cells at base, bristle-like upwards. The fronds are monomorphic, rarely dimorphic, approximate or distant, one to many pinnate on and pitulate. Veins are free, Dichotomous or reticulate, lumina obliquely hexagonal without internal small veins. The sori are usually on two to several uniting veinlets, marginal or submarginal confluence, or lonely on veins apically. Indusia are membranos from submarginal, often as wide as pineal margins, opening outward. Basally adnate, laterally free or adnate. The spores are 32, 32 per sporangium. Tetahedral, globose, trilet or monolet. The distribution of the family Linsaiceae is that it is a pantropical family but with several species extending into temperate regions in South America East Asia and Australasia in Lettonen et al. 2010. It is the greatest diversity is found in the Old World tropics. Two non-endemic genera with four species in New Zealand and one endemic species. It has also cultivation that Linsae or necklace fern, it is a genus of plants in the family of scrow ferns. They are native to Hawaii, Puerto Rico, and Pacific Basin, excluding Hawaii. They have also pinnate leaves. Individuals can grow to 21 meter. Next is the identification and key to the species of the family of Linsaiceae. It is terrestrial or sometimes epiphytic ferns. The rhizome is creeping, covered with brown, entire, non-peltate, non clathrate non scales, and identification key for the simple-bladed species of Linsae is also provided. Here are the various species of Linsae. The first representative species is called Linsae adiantoides. Linsae adiantoides is a species of herb in the family scrofferns. They have pinnate leaves. It is endemic to the Philippines, Luzon, Samar, and Dinagat. The habitat and ecology is in terrestrial in forest at lower altitude. The cultivation, this species is taxonomically isolated in Asia. Its closest relatives are in tropical America. So the next representative species is called Linsae appoinsis coppel. 
Linsaia poinsettia scopel is endemic in Mindanao, North Cotabato Province of Kidapawan City, Barangay Ilumaves, Energy Development Corporation, Mount Apo Natural Park. It coordinates of the general area 2,000 to 2,150 meter. This species is lower abyssal. The lamina surface is showing um, immature. It is showing immature sori. The next species is called Linsae encifolia. Linsae encephalia, the lamina up to 45 times 22 cm, simply pinnate, the pinnate up to 12.5 times 1.5 cm, very narrowly oblong obtuse, base and equally conate, entire to shallowly crenate, glabros on both surfaces, veins anastomosing, the sori up to 0 0.5 mm. Broad, linear, and marginal. Also, the indusia is linear, semi-transparent, and arrows. The distribution and habitat. The habitat is wet situation in shade in forest. This species is called Linsae orbiculata. Linsae orbiculata is a fern native to Southeast Asia. The name orbiculata means a small circle, ring, which refers to the shape of the leaves of this fern species. The edges are rounded and it's evergreen throughout the year. So it is rounded and it is color evergreen. Linsae orbiculata is very variable, and it is possible a complex. The typical form types 5 to 10 cm, lamina 1 pinnate, the pine is orbicular or flabulate, and the sori is marginal continuous. It is found on the one hand, and on the other is the form known as L. hainanensis. The types up to 28 cm, fully 2 pinnate, and pinyols rhomboid. This species is called Linsae philippinensis. Linsae philippinensis is endemic in Mindanao, in Davao Oriental, province of San Isidro Municipality. Barangay La Onion approach in Mount Hamigitan Range Wildlife Sanctuary. It is located in lower mo mountain forest and coordinates of the general area of 1,500 to 1,600 meter. It is lower, abyssal surface, fertile lamina showing a marginal sori. So, that's, that is the Linsae philippinensis. The next representative species is called Linsae repens. Linsae ripens is endemic in Luzon, Camarines Norte province of Labu municipality, Barangay Tulay na Lupa, approach in Mount Labu, and log over Dipterocarp forest, epiphytic, and it coordinates of the general area 600 to 650 meter, and is lower abyssal, the surface of fertile fronds, fronds showing um, interrupted marginal sori. So that is the Linsae repens. So those are the various species of Linsae. So we are going to proceed, proceed on conclusion. It is the family of Linsae CA or lace fern. Plants mostly in soil or on rocks. Rhizomes are short to long, creeping. It is hairy or scaly. The leaves is one to three times pinnately compound, usually glabrose. The sori is marginal or submarginal. The indusium is either lateral and opening toward the margin, or the sori 
protected by a reflex segment margin. Sporangia with the annulus vertical, spores mostly trilet, tetrahedral globose. About um, seven genera and 200 species distributed in the tropical regions. So here are the following resources. Thank you for listening and God bless.